On April 3rd, Wisconsin voters head to the polls in an open presidential primary that has brought a blitz of advertising to the state. But at the University of Wisconsin, young voters say expensive TV spots won't sway their vote, mostly because they simply don't watch television. As a student, I personally don't watch a lot of TV, and I know that a lot of students don't have the time or a TV in general to watch. Um, most people stick to so, um, social media, to Facebook, Twitter, the like. I think ads, uh, specifically television ads towards the younger crowd um, doesn't really work that much. I think getting out and actually outreaching and other students talking to other students is primarily the way that a message sort of spreads among students um, through social networking and, and other avenues like that. I don't think advertising really has as much of an impact um, on the younger crowd. I think that a lot of supporters on campus. I've seen a lot for Ron Paul, not so much for um, Mitt Romney, but I think that uh, the message has been getting out, negative or positive, um, either online or just through different students promoting. Advertising in the state has been a perpetual force throughout the year, so Wisconsin is no stranger to the media attention that comes along with a major election. Wisconsin has received a significant amount of national coverage among battleground states in the last year. Governor Scott Walker continues to be a figure with a divided public perception. Students say an endorsement from Walker in the presidential race could negatively affect their vote in the general election. For me personally, um, I think it would cause a lot more skepticism. Um, I'm v not very familiar with a lot of Scott Walker's you know, endorsements in general, kind of what he stands for, um, but just because of the hype and the media attention, I think it would definitely make me think twice before I considered that candidate over another um, that may be endorsed by someone else. But even Republicans say they're ambivalent about what a Walker endorsement would mean. It would help, it helps for some people, but the, the general people, the moderates, the people that Mitt Romney especially has a strong base with, would probably be turned away from that a little bit and might go more towards Barack Obama. Wisconsin's political situation still relies heavily on the state's divided politics. While advertising likely won't affect student voting, an endorsement from Governor Scott Walker could affect the results of Tuesday's primary. But voters here will quickly move on to the even more contentious recall election later this spring. From the University of Wisconsin-Madison campus and Washington Week, I'm Kate Chappell.